Developing tonight in North Philadelphia, a nine-year-old boy in the hospital after he was shot in the leg. This is Fox 29 News at 11. I'm Dawn Timoney. Police say that boy was an innocent bystander, and the target of the attack, a 33-year-old man, is dead. Our Steve Keeley with more. A Philadelphia police detective told me it's a miracle the entire family of four wasn't killed in their now bullet-riddled car. A mother, stepfather, and two little children had just got into the Hyundai Sonata to go out somewhere that was stopped in front of their home here on North 12th Street, just past 6 p.m. That's where a 33-year-old neighbor was out talking to another driver who was stopped in a car in front of theirs. And that's when a Jeep Cherokee pulled up suddenly and two shooters got out and started firing at the 33-year-old neighbor. The driver he was talking to sped off to safety, leaving the 33-year-old vulnerable with no cover. So then he opened the doors of the family's car to get in to try and avoid being shot. And the shooters kept firing at him anyway, not even caring about the family, wounding one of the kids, a nine-year-old boy shot in his right leg. The 33-year-old was shot three times as the two shooters fired 23 times at him. He ran for cover again out of the other side of the family's car and then into his Philadelphia Public Housing Authority home. The family's car with bullets in its center console, its car seats, its roof, and its windows. One gunman struck his arm inside the car trying to shoot the 33-year-old where police found bullet shell casings. And that was our Steve Keeley reporting. Again, that 33-year-old man who police think was the intended target died just after 9.30 tonight. The shooting remains under investigation.